Welcome Taurus. I'm back y'all with another video. So let's talk Taurus. Let's see what messages we get for y'all for the month of February. Yes, yes, yes. Honeys. <laughs> All right. So let's see what we get. I want to let you guys know about what I have going on on this channel for the month of February. So, I am going to be doing a giveaway, guys, for five lucky people, all right? Um, you would have to order from my website in the month of February, or you would have to put, book a personal reading with me for the month of February, okay, in order to be entered into the uh, drawing, okay? So, um, I'm going to be doing... A giveaway for five lucky people this is going to be um, for whoever I choose you can choose to get a free reading or you can get a free product from the website so it's going to be your choice you could choose whether you want a product from the website or if you want a personal reading with me okay five people you are the only catch is you have to order from the website and or and or or you have to book a personal reading with me all right so good luck to those all right so oh yeah i want to tell you guys about this oil right here i have a few more of these left okay so if it's still showing that it's active on the website then i still have more left okay but this is the truth oil okay as you can see you might can't see it but it has clear quartz crystals in it as well for clarity this oil is the truth y'all <laughs> This oil is the truth. When I say the truth, the truth. If you want to find out the truth about a situation, if you've been dealing with or mingling around with some thieves, you want to find out the truth. You want to find out the truth about a situation and you're dealing with someone who's a liar. Or if you want to find out if this person is a liar, you hey, this that truth. If you're scared of the truth, don't mess with this oil because this oil is going to bring stuff to the light. They're going to start talking and telling stuff that you didn't even ask for. You hear me? Like, this oil here is the truth, okay? This item is on the website, all right? So, check out the website. All of that information is going to be in the drop box below, all right? So, let's talk tours. Let's see what we get for my tours. Ooh, all right. We got some jumpers. All right. So, Spirit say, let's go. Let's go. We got the nine of cups that did jump out, okay? Ooh, we got the four of cups at the bottom of the deck, the six of wands, king of pentacles so are you disappointed are you disappointed um we got the six of wands something wasn't successful or um you didn't get something that you wanted are y'all being spoiled and bratty here this is also attention as well okay so let's see let's go ahead and get into it let's go ahead and get into it let's get into it the nine of wands Two of Cups, the Six of Swords, okay, Nine of Pentacles, the Eight of Pentacles, the Emperor, Two of Wands, the Wheel of Fortune, and the Seven of Wands, okay. All right, let's see what the, what we got. We got Aries' this energy here. You could be dealing with the Aries. What's the Nine of Cups here? Ooh, Seven of Swords. Okay. Some of y'all could be dealing with the Sagittarius. Okay, what is this? Why is the Seven of Swords here? The three of swords. Uh, okay. Some of y'all want to go out and do... <laughs> some of y'all want some payback, I feel like. Some of y'all want payback. This is you guys' energy. Yep, I feel like y'all pissed. Y'all pissed. There's some jealousy going on or some pettiness. I'm getting like some petty energy. Like, I feel like y'all want to be petty. Y'all want to be petty because this person pissed y'all off. Um, It's like you want to go out and... Do them how they did you. I'm hearing, I should have cheated. Because <laughs> I'm getting like somebody did something. 
somebody did something especially when i see that seven of swords and the three of swords together yeah there's definitely some sneakiness some cheating going on okay like especially with that five of swords in the moon that's spiteful that's like you did you get me i'm gonna get you back type of energy oh yeah the devil yeah some of y'all dealing with the capricorn but i'm getting like y'all y'all want to y'all want to show somebody <laughs> Yeah, you want them to regret stabbing you in the back. Somebody betrayed you. Somebody could have had somebody on the side with the Empress and the Lovers. I'm getting Gemini or Libra energy. Yeah, there was somebody had something more going on on the low. A secret. A secret relationship on the low. You found out about it. Seven of Pentacles. Maybe you've been patiently waiting. Like you gonna, I feel like you gonna, you gonna knock this person outside the head. They ain't even gonna know what's coming. They ain't even finna know what is what hit them. Okay, look at this. The Tower and the World. Ooh, it's like it all came crumbling down. Mm. There's a lot of transformation that's getting ready to happen here. Yeah, there's a lot of transformation that's getting ready to happen here. Yep. more waiting okay it's like you're waiting for this person to let their guard down because you're gonna you gonna mess their ass up you gonna mess their ass up why's the two of cups here you felt like you i feel like you thought that this was the perfect union like things was going good with this two of cups and this six of wands like yeah you know like a lot of people might look up to this relationship People might say relationship goes, relationship goes, but there is just something going on here. There's something going on here, something that you saw, and it could be with the Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio here. I feel like you may want to separate. You want to separate from this person. Four of Swords and the Eight, the Four of Swords and the Ten of Pentacles is separation, and then the Eight of Cups is walking away. So you want to walk away. And then we got the Six of Swords. So you want to move on. Why well, is the Six of Swords here? Could be dealing with the Sagittarius. But like you just want to move on in peace. Tempers is balance, okay? You want to move on in peace, but something inside of you is like, I'm going to, I'm, this person ain't shit, okay? Like I said, that tower in the world, like, there's a big awakening here that's happening. You just feel regretful. Like, you're feeling, you're having regrets. I feel like you're having regrets. And then you're trying to move forward in a positive way. Like, I feel like you're trying, you tried to move on in a positive way. But... Because you don't, you, you're not really, I get like a lot of times, I call Taurus, I notice Taurus a lot are passive aggressive. I feel like you don't really want to battle with this person. You don't, you, you try to keep things, you try to keep things together in order. But this person got you messed up. This person got you messed up. Now in the past, we got the Nine of Pentacles. In the past, we got Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, the Eight of Cups. You walked away. Okay, you walked away in the past. You were embodying your Empress energy. Okay, your Emperor energy. And you decided the best thing for you to do was to walk away and close the chapter. Because whatever news you got, whatever this news was, it was shocking. Like, it was like, what? It was way left field. Okay? And I feel like you being... Um, Carrying this nine of swords energy. I feel like some of y'all have been like not getting any sleep or worried, extremely worried about this situation. Like I said, you could be dealing with the water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But like you're you were so done in the past, okay? You were spying on this person, King of Cups, like I said, a lot of y'all dealing with the water sign. And they will possibly like comment and look at this eight of wands and the queen of wands. 
They might have, you might have saw something that they said, went through their phone, saw some text messages. They might have been flirting, um, and you feel like this wasn't getting. You feel like you weren't getting anywhere with this person. You wanted this. You want to make this final decision to end this. For some of y'all, it's even a marriage that you just feel like you want to end because it's just too much. Like, this is not the type of relationship that you were looking for. You want this Ten of Cups energy. Damn it. We got the Eight of Pentacles for future energy. Eight of Pentacles and the High Priestess. Could be dealing with the Pisces. I'm getting like a lot of uncertainty um, or the feeling of, you know, that your intuition is telling you that you need to make the right decision. Two of swords and the ace of pentacles. Okay. On how to move forward. So I feel like you're going to be making changes because of how I'm getting like the right decision. You try to make the best decision. You try to make the best decision. You could be working on yourself with that eight of pentacles. Why is the high priestess here? You could be working on yourself spiritually. For some of you, there's a new uh, person that could come in um, the picture. The king of pentacles and the ace of wands. This person could be very financially stable. Okay. And they got that good wood wood or that good good good. Okay. But I'm seeing like you guys turning your back. You might be ghosting this person so you could work on yourself. Work on your goals. Work on your dreams. Work on what you want to do, what you got going on. I see you manifesting here. You're feeling more in control. Going ahead. Yeah, see, we got the emperor and the hierophant. The hierophant is Taurus's energy. So you're definitely feeling more in control. You decide to take control of the situation. Okay. How this other person is doing you. Their energy is the two of wands. Okay. So they're making plans. They're preparing themselves. Um, I'm getting like there could be a Leo involved. But we got the Ace of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio's energy. I'm getting someone could be offering. This person could be offering you some type of gift. Okay, Queen of Pentacles. That's you guys' energy. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Um, maybe they're having the confidence to be more... Uh, to open up more okay but i'm getting like there's going to be some type of offer why is the ace of cups and the strength here yeah the six of pentacles you might be getting ready to get a ring uh, a proposal or moving in together or some type of commitment some type of stability okay this person is going to give you yep the knight of cups they're giving you some type of offer they want to give you something they want to give you some type of gift or some type of offer. And I feel like it's going to be something like a ring, a bracelet, a necklace. It could be for Valentine's Day. Okay. This person going to put you through a lot. Why is the will of fortune? Here? The tower. Woo. You're hoping for a dramatic change in this situation. Yeah, you're over here manifesting. You're trying to manifest some different energy because I feel like this person really made you mad. Like something that they did or something that you saw, something made you mad as hell. Okay. You thought you thought you and this person bond was better than that. Okay. Now with the seven of wands as the outcome, we got the four of cups. Like you're not trying to force nobody in. You're not trying to force them to do nothing. You're not trying to um you ain't trying to force nobody in. Okay. You not. I don't see you forcing nobody's hand. Like they know what's up. Ooh, the lovers. You could be falling out of love with this person. You could be like, look, you gonna have to prove yourself to me. Okay, you gotta prove your love. Seven of Wands. Yeah, stand up for me. Defend me. Take up for me. Show me. Show me something different. Tell these other motherfuckers that who I am and what it is. Okay, stand up for me. Uh, I'm not going to give you my love. You don't deserve my love until you can show me otherwise. Okay, because like I said, what you saw, it devastated you. Okay, you felt betrayed. And some of y'all were even up crying. The Queen of Cups and the Nine of Swords. You, this person probably had you up crying. Okay, look, mm -mm. 
I feel like y'all are y'all are standing your ground and you're taking your love back from this person. You're more standing more in your power with this emperor. You're standing in your power because this person does not deserve you. Um, they haven't they haven't done the work. They haven't done the work. Okay, so you're gonna make this person prove their love to you. Okay, and until they do, you're gonna walk away. You can see this ass from the back. How about that? <laughs> y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. And I will chat with y'all later. Don't forget to check the description box. And I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao.